हाई टू और मैं लवली पीपल आउट दे वेलकम टू माई चैनल आप सभी को मेरे चैनल पर स्वागत है सो टूडेज वीडियो इज गोइंग टू बी येट अनदर सैलड वीडियो आई नो द कॉम्बिनेशन माइट साउंड रियली और टू यू और माइट साउंड इट लिटल ऑफ बट ऑनेस्टली यू गोट यू गॉट ट्रस्ट मी ऑन दिस वेन वाटर मेलन एंड फेटा चीज वेन दे आर मैरिड द फ्लेवर्स आर टर्न आउट रियली अमेजिंग Amazing. I can't explain how amazing. And honestly, watermelon is my favorite food. Fruit. I've been eating it throughout the summer. And feta cheese. I've fallen in love since I ate back when I was in Dublin. So it was really amazing. I since then love feta cheese. So it's a Mediterranean recipe. And for you guys, like. coming up with just a simplified version of the recipe it's just the game of the dressing and keeping it really simple i mostly shoot my introduction the very next day so that i can enjoy what i what i've prepared and i can come to a conclusion like which is really best and which you can really try out so in the recipe in the video i have tried i have made two types of feta cheese salad one which first one i made it in the appetizer form the second one is exactly in the salad form the appetizer one uh, i did not enjoy that much as compared to the second one because uh, the first one and first one the dressing was just drizzled on top the second one we have completely drenched uh, the watermelon and feta cheese in a dressing and i personally enjoy salad which is juicy which is drenched in the dressing same with mom she did not enjoy the first one but she enjoyed the second one most so if if you ask me which do i recommend i recommend trying out the second one the first one it's a really good it's just a drizzle of the dressing so you might feel that something missing out on it so actually kids would really love it because they would find it really appealing colorful and attractive to their eyes so you can or you can serve it to the guest but make sure you serve it really chill add the drizzle of the dressing when you are about to serve it don't add the dressing and just refrigerate it because it will start to watermelon will start leaving its water so it's recommended you serve it really chill and when you are about to serve that's when you drizzle the dressing and uh, pretty much it uh, i got my feta cheese from big bazaar uh, you can find it in supermarkets but personally if you want you can check in big bazaar online store they do deliver uh, home this salad recipe is very ideal for as a brunch or an or on any sunny day like you have just gone out just prepare the salad refrigerate it and when you are back home have this salad it feels really refreshing you go out you feel dehydrated this is the best fruit for hydration and watermelon has been my favorite ever since childhood so yes you can enjoy this delicious i won't recommend this for dinner because it's not ideal for dinner salad this is ideal for like good uh, brunch options or like good like if you're going out and you're coming it's like especially in this humid and hot climate in india especially in oh my bahut garmi hai bahut 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 so uh you can still see i am standing with my fan on i'm sorry if that sound is bothering you but it's really difficult to stand without fan on and that's it uh, keeping it really simple uh you can enjoy the video let's start with the video before we get started with the video if you enjoy my videos if you love watching my videos please hit that like button subscribe to my channel hit that bell icon and you'll get notified every time i upload a video and that's all please keep sharing your love and endless blessings let's ru
for balsamic glaze we'll be taking balsamic vinegar any balsamic vinegar will do but always remember to check in the ingredient list if there is sugar content present if not then only go ahead and add 3 teaspoons of brown sugar and this mixture we will be heating on a low flame not even on medium flame because there is a tendency that you might end up burning your balsamic vinegar we will heat this up until it starts reducing in its nature and until it has evaporated you can check it that when the vinegar will stick all over your spoon that is when it's ready you can see it's little thick in texture you can totally skip this step this is really optional but i prepare different types of salads so i decided to make a balsamic glaze for myself after uh, turning off from the gas you can store it in a bowl and refrigerate it it will stay for one month in refrigerator and that's all